like I said in my keynote speech, the issue really is on the house of implementation. How do we actually collaborate together? And I think it's important to recognize here that we move one step at a time in the first step that we have undertaken in Brunei, in Brunei, is delivered on those three things. Number one, completed yeah, the uh, project implementation framework, uh, the roadmap, yeah, uh, what we envisage to do, including, for example, very clearly identifying areas for transboundary collaboration with Sarawak, because Sarawak surrounds Brunei. Mm -hmm. yeah? So there's a more direct relevance there. Uh, the second one, the second one is uh, setting up, for example, uh, HOB National Council you know, in the country that will help steer not just the work of the third entity, the Harabonia Center, uh, but also the issue of, for example, uh, competitive land use. Now remember, we were talking about coal mining, we were talking about oil and gas exploration, we were talking about other industries, we were talking about residential development, and, and, and here we are, you know, uh, putting aside, putting aside uh, as much as 60% of the total land area. So obviously there's going to be quite a number of stakeholders yeah, who have an interest of the 60%. And, uh, and, and having the, uh, the council in place would give us a vehicle to at least bring in all those stakeholders into one forum to debate, for example, yeah, the issues of alternative use and, and you know, what, what the priority is. Yeah. Now, I can imagine what, what uh, Malaysia and Indonesia would, would be doing pretty much the same thing. Yeah, and we'll hear more of that when we meet them next month in Pontiana, the second trilateral meeting. If I may follow up with that from the question, I mean, Luna has been sitting on this uh,